right here, the first car in line. With the, uh, you know, just sitting, talking, and chatting away. I mean, it was unreal, unreal. You, I can't say any more than that. The accident happened in 98. I was with my fiance. We were gonna go stop and have some dinner and then go home. Uh, we were at the corner of 35 and Oak Lawn. Stopped at a red light, uh, right at the feeder road where the highway is. Just chatting away, waiting for the light to change. We just got slammed from behind and pushed out into the, to the road. Uh, apparently a drunk driver had hit us. Um, he, the cop estimated probably about 45 miles an hour. He didn't try to apply his brake or anything. He just slammed into the back of us. The automatic roll bars shot up, broke this, the convertible roof. The whole back of the car crumpled up, and um, we got out. But the car did exactly as it was designed. We were able to get out of the car. Um, they didn't have to pry us out or anything. The doors were still functioning, even though the back was just completely crushed. It took us a few minutes to figure out what's going on, but we got out, and then we realized we're okay. I mean, it's, it's such a it's amazing feeling that you're okay, that everything's gonna be good. And then the fact of what happened hits you, and you just get, you get sick to your stomach. We were in a convertible. We could have been thrown over, been thrown out, rolled. The what ifs are endless. Police came and said that car saved our lives because had we not been in a car that was designed the way it was, it would have probably have, have killed us. That's the only thing you've got going for you is the car you're in. If you want to take every bit of control out of your life, be hit because wherever the car goes, you're going and there's nothing you can do. You have absolutely no control over your life. You know, the trauma is mental more than it is anything else because the physical wasn't that bad. No one has a chance of getting out of this life alive, you, you, period. So you might as well enjoy everything you can and the people that are around you and remember to tell them you love them and take the time with them because tomorrow they may not be here or you might not be here. So enjoy that time.